All right guys, so I broke my champagne pop the other day. It was really depressing, but I realized I could fix it, so this video is gonna show you how. Then since it's already broken, I'm gonna go ahead and finish crushing it up all the way and make it as fine as you can. That's really important. Then as soon as you're done crushing it up, you're gonna put it back into the compact case that it came in, like you see here. Then you're just gonna take your rubbing alcohol and I'm actually gonna pour it in the top, that way I don't drown my champagne pop and I can regulate how much I put in there. And then I'm just gonna pour it all along my um, broken makeup. So this can be eyeshadow, foundation, blush, in this case it's a highlighter, whatever it is. Then you're gonna stir it all up and then add more rubbing alcohol as you see needed. You really want it to be all mushy and just easy, like easily moldable. That's really what the goal is. When you're stirring it up, you wanna be sure that every piece of makeup is covered with the rubbing alcohol for best results. Then you're just gonna go in and you're gonna to wanna to smooth out your product as much as possible. So I'm just going in with a butter knife and I'm gonna smooth it out. It doesn't have to be perfect because you still have a couple more chances to fully mold it, but you want to get it as flat as you can. And then I'm gonna tap it as well to try and get all the air bubbles out. Now I'm gonna go in and clean around the edges just so that way when it's all done, it looks completely new. So here's what it looks like. There looks like there's actually hope for my champagne pop and the good news is that there will be. So I'm just gonna let this sit to dry for about 45 minutes to an hour. Now I didn't close the top just because it has like an alcohol -y, rubby alcohol smell. So I wanted to try and let that air out as much as I can. But I'm going to take a napkin and I'm gonna take something flat. So in this case, I'm just using a quarter. You can use the bottom of a powder brush, whatever you want. But this is gonna be the final molding stage. And you're also gonna take some of the leftover rubbing alcohol off. So you can see a little bit there on that napkin. And you're gonna to wanna to do this a couple of times and you're gonna get it in the shape that you really want to and as flat as you can. So now that I'm done doing that, this is what it will look like. And then here are the couple napkins that I use and you can see the rubbing alcohol that is soaked up. So we're almost done here and it's going to be amazing, but I'm just gonna let this sit to dry overnight and let it finish molding. All right, so this is the next day and this is my champagne pop and I can clearly touch it without putting a dent in it. And it's still really pigmented, just good as new. And as you can see here, I'm just gonna rub it across my hand and you can see it is just about as new. So thanks so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe guys. Bye.